Welcome back to Endor. Uh, for those of you that Endor missed, Voya Edition. For, <laughs> for those of you that missed the uh, character creation video, you should watch that because I explained what's happening and stuff. And I'm not going to do I missed that apparently. Yeah. That's watch the beginning, but don't watch the end because it's like really lame looking at tables and being like, oh, that's a good Wow, fuck you, Paul. I, I just say us us being like, oh man, I don't know what race I want to be for like right. an hour. Paul it's says, not, it's not that, that right interesting. Now. Paul dies. New character. Um, God. Can I do that too? <laughs> can I reroll my HP? No, none of you can reroll anything, fags. All right. Seriously, so, no, I offered you that you could get my, like, whatever, <laughs> and I would take your one in Corinia if I could reroll on the HP on this. <laughs> you take my one, I'll take your eight? Yeah. Maybe. Uh, no, dude, I already have like 40 fucking health on that Slayer. I don't. I don't yeah, I know. Either. I have like 47 HP or, so, or something on my uh, on my what? dude now. What? Yeah. Yeah, dude, we're nah, level I four, man. I think it's 22. Or and something. you give you give us the fucking favorite class bonus plus the fucking flavor bonus, bro. I take health every level. I fuck that. God. I get dude, one extra. health. I get an essential one con. Dude, I have eight fucking like natural skill points. I don't need any more of that shit. You can always use more skills. I mean, I just need diplomacy, right? The problem are is, a, are you a rogue now, Sobo? I'm a slayer. Oh, okay. The problem is that if I took the thing is uh, my drawback is meticulous, which gives me negs on untrained skill checks. So if I just abuse that by training all the skills, that feels shitty. What, what does that feel shitty? A meticulous person would learn all the things. Nah, dude. Or just not attempt them. That guy literally doesn't give a shit about history, like at all. Or Arcana, like at all. So he just doesn't roll it. Or like lots of... Yeah, it just doesn't roll it. Exactly. But I'm not going to put a skill point in something that I don't give a fuck about. Alright, anyways. Fine. We'll do intros first, and then we'll do some DM talks about what's going to be going on here. Zakai. Yep. How have you been since Wednesday, man? Pretty good. Not uh, bad. Played yeah. some ARAMs. Yep. Played some Shadow of Mordor, watched Worlds, and that was fucking awesome. Starting that free blame. God, I, I just watched uh, C9 last night. It was fucking crazy. Yeah, that was good times. The dream was real. C9. We won. Really? Yeah. Well, our <laughs> game. <laughs> they, they won our <laughs> game. <laughs> and then they lost another, all of them. But, uh, yeah. Sad life. And no. they were so close. No, Koreans uh, master race. Yeah, Koreans yeah. master race. It's better at video games, guys. Nah, okay. nah, it's not better at video games. It's better at, like, actually giving a shit about video games enough to do that sort of thing. Because, like, alright. Are you saying that 16 hour a day practice? Completely off railing momentarily. But Americans, we're lazy as shit. And if we ever <laughs> want to be legitimate in esports, we need to get off that ride. Because. We need to, like, the problem with Koreans is that the first year or two of any competitive game, they suck butt and they don't show up because they're still getting everything set up. And then year three through million, they win because they've got literal houses where you wake up in the morning, you work out with your team, and then you play video games for 12 hours, and then you eat with your team, and then you go to sleep. And then you do that the next day, and 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 the next day. There's no, like, I'm going to go play some solo queue for four hours, and then we're going to go to the bar and get bitches. That doesn't exist. That's why Koreans were awful stop us. And y'all niggas need to get on that, because I'm about sick and fucking tired of losing to Koreans and everything. I refuse to be a foreigner in League of Legends. What about basketball? I still win that, right? <laughs> I refuse to be they, a foreigner. They, they win American football, because it's the only country that they play the sport in. Best sport. That's the thing. I mean... Listen, guys, we got to get good at video games. That's why it's called American football. Paul. Yeah. We win at baseball, yeah. too. Yeah. We win the shit out of baseball. Because <laughs> you Whoa. import a whole bunch of Cubans. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and Dominicans. And I was like, Listen, the people that... Away, all the Cubans and Dominicans were not that good at baseball. Yeah, well, I mean... <laughs> Mexicans, too. Or even Listen. the Japanese now, right? Like The Japs are pretty fucking good, dude. Yeah. Japs are pretty fucking good. They're 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 climbing the fucking walls and shit. It's pretty awesome. To be fair though, Just, ninja kicking off a wall and catching a baseball is pretty OP. So I mean I, that's like a class skill for them, right? Yeah, I think we should take that off the list of things that count <laughs> because I can't do that shit. That's not fair. Um. <laughs> anyways, anything else important happened in the last couple of days, Takai? Nah, nothing, man. You made a character. I did. Since last night. Yeah, that happened. Great. All right. Bergson, anything since Thursday? Found out that 
finished Shadow of Mordor, first yeah. of all. Yeah. Nice. Already? Yeah. Baller, man. Turns out I you mean, didn't uh, actually kill Sauron. It's like a 24-hour game, right? Spoilers. You don't kill Sauron because, you know... That would be ridiculous. Like, like it's, it's like a straight up, like, around 24-hour game and you'll you'll have finished most of, like, the story missions. Yeah. All of them, actually. Hold on, two seconds. Plus, tell, tell everyone plus about like Shadow a shit of ton of the, I'll back two seconds. Plus a shit ton of the side missions. Besides that, not so much. Watch some uh, new, not new, watch an old English TV show I've never, I had never seen, The In Between Us. The actually what? kind of funny. In Between Us. I, I've never heard of that. Never heard of what? In Between Us? It's just some random in English TV show I found. Oh, Jesus. Kind of funny. Dude, you need to get on that Walking Dead grind, because it's starting in like a week. I, I I've watched the first three sh uh, seasons, and then I kind of like got meh in you it. Need to, you need to not do that and just stop being incorrect about things. The Walking Dead is actually the dream. That and Sleepy Hollow. You should get caught up on Sleepy Hollow, too. That's a good fucking show. Started watching that last night. It's fucking good. Um, Paul, did you do anything? No, I called immigration. They're like, oh shit, yeah, we should have totally uh, made an appointment with, with you to move your shit along. Yeah, thanks. Uh, so when is that going to happen? Oh, we're going to send a message and like uh, call us again Six in three weeks, weeks if uh, you don't hear anything. S sweet. Pretty good. Uh, and other than that, I didn't catch any salt today for uh, Karinia, so that was pretty good. Uh, hey, maybe we can start that. Yeah, yeah well, a few seconds. Where is <laughs> <laughs> new Karinia? New Karinia, more like worst Karinia, apparently. God. I should, I should just railroad the shit out of you guys. Dude, just straight kneel the campaign. Straight um, kneel, kneel it. No, but uh, I don't know. Uh, other than that, no. I mean, it's been two days. Come on. Like, I, I can't work. I can't do shit. You did some some uh, World of Warcraft, though. I mean, I'm, you got I'm a still new, on that World of Warcraft line. You got a new guild name. Got a new guild name. Cause, Wait, because you have Zach, a new guild name? Zach got tired of being Team Sobomit and Sobo not being on. <laughs> so wait, what's the new guild name? Bro, I can't even. Well, how about you, you log up. in yeah, you gotta go look. and find even. out and show some interest in your guild. Yeah. I mean... Berkson, I'm sure. so disappointed in you. <laughs> Let's be honest. He's not. I mean, really. Uh, is your name? Did you do anything special other than get sick and die? Get sick and die. You caught Ebola. <laughs> Jesus. I, was sick, I was sick. I was sick on Monday. All about the life. But he didn't throw it up. Like all day long, and then it got better on like Tuesday, Wednesday. This doesn't and it came sound like back, better. And it came back on Thursday and like kicked me in the head. I was like, please no. Uh, is Renee is patient zero for the Ebola virus in Canada? Yeah. And somehow he's transferred it over the internet to me because my throat's starting to hurt like a motherfucker. Yeah, it's now gone viral. Wow. That was literally <laughs> the worst. That was. <laughs> <laughs> That was the <laughs> worst fucking joke I've ever heard in my life. I like that one. I <laughs> hate no, you no. for that. <laughs> no, that come on. <laughs> that was so fucking bad. Oh, yeah. Wait, look Other at Berg logging in, checking our guild. <laughs> yeah, right of course, bro. You should I be need, I can't even. For that. Uh, uh, that's it. Right on. All right. So... For those of you that are lazy and didn't bother checking out the other video, even though I just told you to, for those of you that did, I love you. Um, so we are 500 years in the future. Uh, Dell is the only remaining party member. Uh, he is beginning to fade. Uh, he disappeared for quite a while, uh, took off, came back with horrible scars, face all mangled, body all mangled. Um, but he's back. Uh, Matrana is the only one that's confirmed not dead, or not confirmed dead, rather. 
Uh, yeah. he, Assumed dead, but not confirmed. Yeah, he he done took off to another plane somewhere. So confirmed that that. Dead. Well, totally not, gonna be there. Not confirmed undead either. So, uh, mm-hmm. Thad died, you know, normal Thad death. Kelly died, normal Kelly death. Uh, Aaron actually ended up falling to the dark side, becoming the great evil bitch, and then getting fucked Shit. on. Um, Bre- oh, Breslin. Breslin's still around. That's the other wizard that's still alive. Breslin still exists. He's still in the Londe. He still never came out to be, like, pure evil? Nope. Still banging chicks. Yep, still banging bitches. Chilling. Hanging out. And killing off low-level party members? Yep. Okay. <laughs> Only low-level party and members. And failing at it. Good and muffled. failing at it, though. <laughs> God. Well, it worked in the end. I mean... I mean, it sort of fanned out, I guess. Uh... Mm. Everyone else is dead. The Great One never re-emerged. Uh, the war essentially ended in a stalemate. The lines really never got pushed any further than they were nice. uh, at the time of. Maps now exist. Uh, you can link around the old Endor map if you like. I'm going to be making some adjustments to it, but generally that one is going Please to be Please do, Takai. Please fucking do. Um, <laughs> nah. Yeah. No, actually, give me a link, because I have a fucking map. I already bought one. It's 50 gold. I want a goddamn link. I'll put it up on Imgur real quick. (laughs) Yeah, throw it on Imgur. Link that around. Uh, Actually, I don't think the city you guys are in is on that map right now, though. I'm going to send it to Uh, Paul and Liam. Where's the map? Not Bird. (laughs) Dude, that map was made a year ago. (laughs) Seriously, that's kind of serious. Totally joking, man. Come on. Oh, yeah, no, it is. All (laughs) things on there. Like the, the map I'm using for Grinia, it's just like a per needed basis of like, all this stuff has stuff in it, but I just don't fill it in, because you haven't New been there. New Hampshire? So. Guys, there's people here. What race they are, I don't know. But they're people. Uh, <laughs> uh, as Richard for Moore, not really sure. a general, like, how this is going to go, we're now a year into playing this. Uh, I'm going to be mean. We're going to throw big monsters and stuff. We're going to have big Which fights. Which is great, because we all serious. rolled pretty shitty. Yeah. It's going to be it's awesome. Gonna be, <laughs> hey, at least it's we're going to get to be good. Roll, right? Well, sure, is exactly. Real. That's the, the good thing about this. Listen, we have a bunch of spellcasters who are probably going to either shit stomp every <laughs> encounter or die horribly. Like, no. Uh, like, no, no, no. We'll be fine as long as we only have one encounter a day. Yeah, yeah that's never going to happen. Yeah. I mean, we'll Have see. Have you seen how we roll? That's true. Have you seen it? That's true. Uh, you guys are currently located in a small town named Altnain, uh, which is about two and a half days east of the Londe. Uh, you guys can go ahead and explain why you're here. You guys decided to start at level two, which means you guys are notable adventurers already, so you'll have to explain to me why you guys know each other and such as well. Uh, as far as notable people in the city goes, there's the Trade Master, who is a representative of Delmore. Um, and the dragons is the, in general. It's totally in the map already. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Uh, who's a representative of Delmore and the dragons, but he's kind of a bit of a bitch. Uh, the city is generally a nice place, though it is very, very uh, polluted at the moment. There's a shitload of uh, industry and such that happens here. And because of that, the waters are pretty toxic, and uh, there's a nice big smog cloud that goes over it. But you can pretty much buy anything you fucking want to out of this place. This is you kind see of the, the welcome to Beijing side. Uh, no, more of like a Shanghai, anyways. This is like the the welcome to the world. Give me all of your fucking shit so I can sell it to other people. City. Nice. Um, almost like what uh-huh. Kelly wanted her city to be. This is kind of could become it. Uh, it's kind of corrupt. The economy uh-huh. is absolutely amazing, but there's a, a pretty decent law force around here, and it's not a very shitty city. Uh, so who are you guys? What the fuck are you doing here? What are you guys known for? Why are you level two? Right. Let's roll a D100 and go in order. Do it. Okay. I'm going oh, last. Geez, you are going oh. last. Oh. No, you're definitely going first. And Sakai is going second. Apparently. Let's do it. Oh. There we go. That's so the order good. we go in. <laughs> the order go we roll is the order we go in. What do you know? <laughs> God, good rolls, guys. I'm so fucking hyped. Yeah. <laughs> I need to get my random weather generator up. Hold on, I'm pretty pretty sure I'm going to need this shit. Yeah, we're dead. No, you're you're first. So to set the scene here... No, 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 you're definitely... You rolled number one. Literally number one, Paul. So to set the scene, uh, you guys are in the slum ward, uh, which is filled with overcrowded... It's overcrowded uh, with beggars and other kind of poorish people. 
Um, the inn is a two-story building, brick and timber, uh, thatched roof, unusually tall ceilings for some fucking reason, uh, but it is still a two-story building. Uh, there's rooms in the back with wooden cots. Uh, innkeeper is a young female half-orc named Brada. Uh, she has a large magical shield that she carries around with her and brags about constantly. Uh, because it was built by her father, who is a great half-orc armor. Um, yeah. There is... Uh, well, it is the full of name? people. Sorry? The White Pipe. <laughs> yep. Yeah, Paul's writing everything down. I don't have to. Well, I'm writing. I mean, I'm writing down what I deem important. Uh, the inn is full of people. You guys are all sitting at a table doing whatever it is that you do. And who the hell are you, Paul? All right. So my name is Annam. I am an undine, which is like a, a, a water being something mixed in my human bloodline. Uh, my hotness is awful. Uh, I haven't rolled for that. I should probably do that, huh? Yep. Please be a three. Please be a three. Let me understand. Charisma, right? Yep. Yeah. It, but it looks like I'm uh, I'm like from a horror movie where like the monster is just a drowned chick. Like that's me. Like uh, my 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 skin is all discolored and blotchy, and you see like you know bluish green like around the mouth, like the veins kind of pop out. It's just sea color. Looks looks like I'm a fucking drowned victim, but I'm somehow walking around. Do you have the uh? I know you drew up a picture of this. Do you have the link to that, by the way, so I can show it? It's, uh, uh, it's in the roll twenty, right? I see it, but it's kind of a small image. Yeah, I'll, let me see if I can ha if I had it on Imgur or not. Uh, but uh, other than that, I'm a shaman, mm -hmm. uh, which is one of the new classes that I wanted to try. Uh, and we changed it up a little bit, so you're a water shaman. I gave yeah. you the uh, the favorite class bonus to get more water spells, as if you were like a like a human wizard type deal, yep. rather than whatever the shit your shitty one was, where you get like water tide or some shit, power or like some that. stupid nonsense. Uh, uh, here it is. I got it. I'll I'll uh, just link it in the yeah, uh, Twitch chat. Uh, I am here because I'm bros with uh, Azrinin's character, who I don't even know the name of, or I I knew <laughs> but I forgot. Uh, like icon or I'll, go, I'll go after leaving because ours are intertwined. Okay. Um, so I, I'm kind of just hanging out with him because he helped me out in the past. Uh, I like to speak with spirits. Uh, I am uh, in tune with nature also as shamans are and, and a secondary goal of mine because the city is pretty polluted uh, is to find out what the fuck's going on here? And that's why. Good shit. Good shit. All right, I'll go oh, I have a really sweet cloak. Yeah, you do have a pretty sweet cloak. Paul, oh, answer me on Skype. So. Alrighty. Um, yeah, me and uh, Paul come from. Fuck, I forget the name of the the, the big city. Thalande? Yeah, uh, Thalande. We both come from Thalande. Um, my character is a sorcerer with the vampiric bloodline. Uh, he's got eyes that are almost red, but they kind of look uh, a little bit more brown than red currently, because he's, he's still pretty weak. But um, yeah, he used to be a really good guy. Uh, which is noted in that I have a plus 17 diplomacy modifier. I would go around, you know, go to hospitals. I was a doctor. I'd go around and I'd help people out. Doctors don't uh, have high diplo. They have high int, bro. No, 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 no. I wasn't <laughs> like would a actual doctor. Out. I was just like, like, over to actually actually be like bro, I was like, he, I was like Robin and, Williams. But then I'd he became a vampire and, and then he just sucked their blood instead. That's no, not... no, 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 no. Okay, I mean, you could be Robin Williams. That's fine. But you're having high diplo doesn't make you a doctor. Bro. He was walking no, 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 around, so you... like he started out having high diplo and helping people. Then he started sucking them off and now he's just sucking their blood. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Then my whole family 
got murdered and I kind of went a little bit insane for a little while and I managed to get Paul to sell half of his soul so I could bring them back to life. Uh, but the devils were like, look, that's not enough. So I went into the, the hospital and I managed to convince someone to sell their whole soul. And yep. now I kind so of So one and away. a half soul. They came back, but they were undead, so now they kind of freaked me out. Uh, mm -hmm. So I ran away from them with Paul. We're now uh, lovers. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> what, what's your name? So I don't forget. It. Isaiah. Oh, oh my god, we're going to have a long triangle. This is the thing. Excellent. Ferguson, who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Why are you level I, 2? I am... Think Sylvan up. Goblin extraordinaire. God, I'm so killing you this week. <laughs> this is how, if you want to be able to reroll your health at some point, by the way, from a DM's perspective, because apparently that's a thing we're doing on YouTube now, name your character something fucking stupid, because then your DM's like, no, this guy's dying. This guy. Next, give it to you. So just Go to be clear, Bergson, can you type something in chat so that we can see the name and feel the name? Dude. Yeah. Fink Silver Knob. Yeah. This is a thing that I'm dealing with now. It Excellent. is literally the best name ever. Come on. Excellent. Uh, while you guys are doing this, can you all link me your character sheets? I can yeah. put up a folder with them all. No, I may not. Wow. Yeah. Good. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of like a little paranoid goblin mm -hmm. who's also kind of a hunter. hunter. Mm -hmm. So, like, where I got most of my shit from is just doing random jobs around town. And I got one item in particular, like, from a job of killing a werewolf. Who then turned in out to be a werewolf, that I wasn't aware he was a werewolf, so... I mean... So you just killed a guy, and then luckily <laughs> he was a werewolf. No, no, I killed a wolf, and then he turned out to be a guy, right? Wow. Oh, okay. Yeah. The other side. Yeah. It's pretty nuts. Not dude. super stoked about that. Like all by yourself? I mean, I like to take most of the credit, but probably not. Oh, Let's okay. be honest. Okay. So you're the, like, the other guy got actually just mauled by You him. had a group of yeah. bros with you, and the other guy just got killed. Yeah, yeah, got probably. Like, okay. I'm a scrawny little bitch. So, yeah. And ugly. Oh. And ugly as fuck. Paul's I also a three, have a Berg's three in hotness. I'm a 14, the guy's a 13. And how do you know the rest of the bros? Uh, I, I've probably been following, uh, and this is where the love triangle comes in, I've been following the, the lady, the undying lady for a while, Enough. in the shadows. Mm -hmm. just, just just looking. Right. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just stalking. He's a voyeur. Yeah, it's a thing. Yeah. Got it. Sadly. So whether they've noticed me or not, that's that's completely up to them. <laughs> I mean, listen, he considers himself a party member without them actually. Yeah. Knowing I was gonna yeah. skip character intros, but if that's how you want to do it, we can just do that. That's fine. <laughs> that's fine. I don't need to write I'm... anything up this week. Y'all can just kill each other. I'm no, cool no, with no. This. We, we like totally notice God when he's like following us around. But it's like you know, a kitten shows up at your door, and then you just like put out a bowl of milk every now and then, right? right. No. Not it's kind of like that. I just kick the kitten. Uh, guys, well, guys, we don't mm -mm. look. If it's a goblin, I got exactly what you need. One more, I got something for everyone. Kitten? <laughs> yeah, yeah some for everyone. Yeah, you just ah, feed bufo, the goblin bufo. kitten. No, 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 it's alcohol. <laughs> this alcohol is specifically made for goblins, boggers, and primitive humanoids. Wow, that's Dude, racist. That's... Wow. <laughs> <laughs> racist drinks, I like it. <laughs> Primitive humanoids. Yeah, so so like when we go to sleep, like we leave out a ball of bug of uh, bufo, bufo for uh, for Fink. They literally make bufo by like fermenting a dead frog in alcohol. Good. And sometimes leaving the frog in the bowl. Good. <laughs> I don't think that's how alcohol works. <laughs> it's favorite of goblins, so like I would probably enjoy it. As a matter very fact, much. I'm about seventy three percent sure that's not how alcohol works. <laughs> Uh, Takai, who are All you? Right. Why are you level two? How yeah. do you know the party? Sounds good. My name is Ethan Doxon. 
Um, I come from a very small little town down uh, called Orly, which is in like the southwest, I guess, corner sort of ish. Anyway, um, I am a cleric <laughs> of the god Kelsier, also known as the Survivor. Mm -hmm. um, and so I basically got it by once I learned about Kelsier um, and all of his teachings, I decided to go basically back. Uh, I've been kind of just traveling, trying to spread the word because it's not a very large religion yet. So I'm spreading the word basically. And so just having to, uh, the main tenets are protection and healing. So I've been going from village to village, healing the sick and teaching about Kelsier and his goodness. Mm -hmm. And then continuing on to like protect those who are getting, you know, robbed and shit like that. So I met the party basically just on the road. Um, I kind of stuck with them because I saw them like take out some bad dudes. Right on. Why are you level two? Uh, again, because I've actually like had to um, do some serious fighting against bandits and stuff to protect the village on my travels. Oh, right on. So you've so. just kind of been roaming and taking shit out as you see it? Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right. I am grabbing you guys tokens right now. And then you can roll for initiative. Just kidding. Um, what All right. Is... <laughs> charm person, you're now my friend. Kill yourself. That's not how charm, charm is. person also literally says that he won't hurt himself, though. Let's have a threesome. <laughs> have you seen person? your ugly goblin? That, that would like absolutely be the equivalent of hurting myself. <laughs> True. The fuck are you guys for? Initiative. They're, they're just. They're just Deeper like initiative because they're smart asses. I'm not. Yeah. What the fuck's wrong with you guys? Uh, so what's that for all initiative? Uh, I'm listening to the DM guys. Yeah. Come on. Who, <laughs> who did I forget? Probably me. Oh yeah, you're just a human, right? Yeah. All right. And you're a paladin or a cleric, rather? Uh, cleric. Yep. Okay. We're gonna use typical cleric number four hundred eighteen. Cool. <clears throat> Alright, you guys should all have control of your characters now. Nice. <clears throat> nope. We're in that HP life. You don't have control of yours, is your name? Oh, yeah. There you go. There we go, thank you. Everything I deal is force damage. What? Yep. You took that trait? All Son the magic of you deal? Every, all the damage I deal is force damage. No, it damage. was only magic damage. Yeah, yeah, not like if I punch somebody, but yeah. my spells. And they all get force plus one punch. damage. <laughs> I <laughs> hit you with my force sword! Dude, there is, isn't there one like that? Uh, there's uh, one Probably. of the new random classes that deals damage based on level, not the weapon type that they're using, no matter what. Yeah, yeah. Bro, I don't, I don't see that on uh, your Yeah, feet. it's uh, it's Wall Priest, oh, and they oh, can oh, the weapon damage is higher, they can just do the weapon damage instead. It's havoc of the society. All spells do force damage? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like He's a god amongst goblins, though, guys. Come on. Still don't believe it. <laughs> I'm just saying. Why is your health bar not displaying for me, Paul? What the shit is this? I, I don't know. There it goes. Got it. It's hiding it. <clears throat> no, I feel like in, in. people are shitting on Fig Silver Knob already, and it's not appreciated. It's because Fig Silver Knob is the I think it's because it's Bergson. I don't know. Yeah. Could be wrong. Could be both. Uh, Alright, so yeah, you guys are in the, uh, the light pipe. Sweet. You know what I Showing do, Sobo? Nice and relaxed, not cool. I'm probably sitting a table away from them, just looking, <laughs> like, straight at them. Alright, so I'm gonna walk up to a random person uh, who is from here. Mm -hmm. Like, I'll ask them, are you from here? And they say yes. Uh, yeah, Jeffrey, male sure. halfling. And, like, how long has the city been, like, polluted and shit? I mean, it's always kind of been shit, uh, but yeah, it's but like, worse. like this is 
is it new like your city can't sustain itself like this yeah it's only been a couple of months that it's been this bad but supposedly they're supposed to be enacting some uh you know don't dump your shit into the water Thing. Don't shit in the streets, guys. That's supposed to be coming out. EPA, EPA is... Uh, but but is did, gonna did be like, something started. happen? Not that I know of. It's just the fucking factories, man. They just dump fucking pollution into the ocean like it's cool. They just pour and pour and pour and pour, and eventually this is what the shit looks like. I mean, there was, there was an explosion from one of the factories a couple of months ago, but that sort of shit happens all the time. Mm. there's just pretty much no rules man it's as long as you're making money and you're paying your taxes you're doing what's right right so there's not really any common courtesy as far as don't you know don't pollute the streets don't pay people like dog shit well it's a free run city man the dragons don't really have that much of a fucking swing here anymore as long as we're paying them Delmore doesn't come out of his fucking hole anyways It's not a way to run the city, man, but I guess it's not. It's not my city. I'm just here to make a couple bucks. I let out a deep sigh (laughs) and go back to think and like rub his his head a little. (laughs) I'm just being one with the chair. (laughs) Alrighty. I'm blending. Then I'll figure out what's actually going on. I approach the, you know what, I bring the, are you a dwarf guy or a human? human. I'm a human. Alrighty. Uh, come with me, Ethan. Let's go find out what's actually going on. Alright. We approach the lovely barmaid. She's not that lovely. Actually, I haven't I, really te- I tell her how lovely she is. <laughs> my dear, you are the most beautiful half-work I've ever laid, eyed upon, ever laid my eyes upon. And the first, probably. She's so beautiful <laughs> that I'm stuttering. She's not. Actually, she told. You know what? <laughs> My diplomacy awkward. says. No, no, that's She bluff. totally is. Believes me. Uh, you can roll a bluff check if you like. But... All right, that's even better. <laughs> She's not really feeling it all that. 30. <laughs> yeah, I mean, she's buying it. Cool. Might I. Ask for your ear for a while, and perhaps some of your knowledge. Sure. What's up? Uh, I would like to know what's going on in the city. We are new here. Me and my friends have just arrived. Anything in particular, or just what's going on in the city? Well, what's going on? We come in, we see all this... Uh, Smog? Well, the rather dark clouds above, and the <laughs> greenish water. It's a city of industry, man. We pump out all the goods that the entire kingdom uses. Everything that's worth anything comes through these borders. Hmm. Then perhaps you know of uh, some people who need protection? Uh, escorting the goods or something like this? A job, perhaps? Sure. You can, there's always people looking to make trade runs. Here to Thalande, here to... Yeah, all over the place, man. You could absolutely just go grab a trade run if you wanted to. Already. In particular, not really, no. It's just, there's literally dozens and dozens and dozens of people that just go outside and get signed up constantly. Uh, if you're looking to look, make a little bit more money, I heard that the uh, uh, the Jungle of Fangs, there was a new uh, crypt that was found in there. Uh, That's supposedly the untapped. But if you just want to go do some trade runs, go talk to... Uh, Go talk to Jamath. Jamath the Hut? <laughs> <laughs> Jaman. 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 Thank you, my dear, for your time. Bikini. I'm Jaman. God damn it. <laughs> I'm Jaman. And I'll be I'm off now. Jaman. And I... I leave with Ethan to return to the party. And I, like, tip my head towards her. Thank her. She nods. I'm like, this city is depressing as fuck. I don't like it here. How do you have plus 12 in bluff, by the way, for mess? Uh, because I have plus 10 to lie. Where is that? 
It's my item, Mask of Stony Demeanor. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I appear to have what appears to be like a stone face. I forgot about your stupid mask. Oh, you don't have a stone face. You're wearing a mask. No, it specifically says that. I'll pull it up even. Yeah, it's a it's a mask that's made of stone. It's magical though, so the mask I know, of but stony... it's still just a it's just a magical mask. It doesn't like become the mask from the mask and like blend. When more in this throat. mask transforms the wearer's face into stony statue. Yeah, so you you're wearing a fucking stone mask. All right, sure, whatever. I don't really care. Yeah. If you're gonna change what it says, that's fine. That's that's not change what it says. You're, you're stone. All right, so then your face is just made of stone. There you go. Hey, all it, all right. it's clearly not a normal face. All right, fine. Yes. Then your face looks <laughs> fucking weird. It's fine. I'm still they can't read it. Like you could be, you could be mafia as fuck. Not. Your hotness doesn't come through if you're just a fucking statue. Dude, totally smexy. No, no, no. It's not how that works. <laughs> all right, boys. We've got a few choices. We can work for Jabba the Hut, or we can go into the Forest of Fangs. Personally, Java's a pretty fat fuck. Uh, not sure if we want to work for that asshole. But then again, the Forest of Fang's a dangerous place. Super scare. Not sure we want to go there either. Yeah, let's see that. So we want to work for the fat fuck or we want to go get fucked up? Wait, wait, what? Why are those the only two options again? <laughs> Guys, when life gives what you lemons... What did you sign this up for? <laughs> you have to make apple juice. I don't think that's how apple, apple juice works. And you can only make apple juice these two ways. <laughs> <laughs> you either have to work for fat fuck or go into a storm cave. That's how you make apple juice, guys. <laughs> It's more than one way to skin a cat, but there's only two ways to make apple juice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Alright. Listen, uh, I, I prefer to just get out of the city. The jungle sounds pretty good, actually. Alrighty. If the jungle sounds <laughs> where you want to be, down for that. Shall I uh, pro procure us a guide? You can just buy a map. I have a map. Because <laughs> they're too. freely available in this in this land. Totally. They <laughs> have a map already. That's... But I mean, a map won't help us from getting lost. Can uh, you, Goblin? I'm, I'm, I'm sure I can find the way. Alrighty. I'll trust you. Uh, as Think. he says, can you, Goblin? And I'm like, I, I'm like looking at talking to me. Think. Wait, you're acknowledging my existence? Oh, I hey. also rub Fink's head. His bald head. <laughs> Get a plus one luck bonus on all future. <laughs> plus one luck bonus for rubbing Fink's head. Because he's got magic head. Oh. Uh, magic leprechaun. Come I'm on. like... Uh, the, the jungle's a dangerous place, bro. Like, there's cats and shit. Uh, roll me also, a, those of you that are from Thalande, roll me a knowledge local. Uh, anyone else, if you're not from Thalande, roll knowledge history. Or knowledge uh, nature, have, that works for me I as well. Can I not those. roll anything because I have two skill points total? <laughs> I, I mean, I, I want to admit that that's roll untrained, which can greatly be seen by the plus zero. You could just have a negative four in modifier. I've put one point in it. There you go, Frank. With like <laughs> bats and shit, and like. There's rumors of this man who can communicate with bats, and yeah, it's a drug. like, like he 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 becomes the bat. Yeah, it's a, it sounds like a druid. Sounds like a vampire. I mean, I I don't know. I'm just saying, like, don't mess with shit like that. 
I mean, I agree. If it's a vampire, I don't want to fight that shit. Yeah, like if it's a vampire, no, but he sounds like a druid. Ferguson's literally just making shit up right now, by the way, guys. That's not what I sent him at all. (laughs) (laughs) I'm so, I'm so like, there's a a druid in the jungle. Like, holy shit. Some of you are not supposed to tell them. If problems with people, I say we stop him. Like, we can at least go find out. If it is a vampire, we can try and get more help because I don't think we could take it Yo, out. Yo, this is canon now, Berg. It's over. Like, this is, <laughs> there's a guy in the woods that talks to bats and has, turns into a bat. This is not canon. Uh, <laughs> all right. I'm, I'm totally down. But I turn to Ethan. They call him like, the Batman. I'm like, Ethan, would you so kindly lead us? And by that, I mean stand in front of me. What is that? <laughs> I said, I mean, just stand, stand here in front of me, please. <laughs> My common sense says, what? You can't, you, you can't dip low players. Yeah. I totally can't. Can't. You can try. I don't like, it's a very persuasive argument, I would say. Yeah, right? it, it sounds like, good saying it. I mean, I'll, please, I'll good sir, stand in front of me and take all the damages. No, 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 mine, my. I was asking him to lead. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I mean, I don't have very good direction sense, but okay, sure. <laughs> I mean, then you you can stand behind. Uh, you can stand beside. What's your name? Anam. Right. So options out I'll of the city. Between you. A, the road that leads back to the Londe. B, you guys could hop on a boat, ferry passage up to say Hearthland. Uh, I'll hop off there and swing around. Uh, or see, you guys can just rough it through the plains until you hit the edge of the jungle. Cool. Uh, uh, would you like is... me to procure us a ride, fellows? Yeah. yeah. But okay. Is there something that goes, like, you know, northwest from Thalande? Yeah. Woods there anyway? Yeah, there's a road that goes from Thalande up to uh, Kerkarf, a.k.a. Castle Carf. Uh, all right. And we should probably find out where the script is exactly. We should probably also get some... And action. not just be like, it's in the jungle. Because <laughs> that would... Trying to Cause find the jungle. I'm those jungles are about shit. seven days across. They're, it's just north of the Dragon Run Mountains. It's the exact same oh, jungle okay. that I you guys it. wandered through a year and a half ago. Yeah, it was a mm-hmm. long time. Yeah. Um... Where, I mean, where, where you were still the whale and it was to battle. Yeah. yeah. Guys, and then guys, made a picture of that. I may, I may be able to get us a boat ride for a lesser cost, if not free. Sure. Go for it. No one's going to stop it. Alright. Sure. Uh, how about, how about I mean, we can always just, we can always just that. sneak on board. I'm going to go find out about the script. Alrighty. Yes. Well, Paul can find out about the script, then I'll go talk to the Okay. So who are you approaching about the crypt, Paul? Uh, well, I mean, Brother was the first lead, right? Brother. So I'll, I'll talk to her. Okay. Like, hey, uh, we heard about that crypt thing in the jungle of Fangs. Do you know someone who knows more about that? Uh, no, I've pretty much just picked it up off of random people. Um, supposedly, uh, there's some tomb from some long-forgotten king that's been grown over uh, and it's, it was just discovered like somebody tried to enter it and got fucking blasted off apparently there's some magic there's some curse on the door uh, it looks undisturbed from what I've heard but uh, this is like fresh information this just happened like I heard about this last night from a guy that was coming through um, he said him and his friends had poked into it and one of his friends is dead now uh, <clears throat> but yeah he you know- just talking about it. Just overheard it. Do you know which guy? Uh, just... yeah. I don't know if he's him? still around, though. Did uh, he stay here? No. Well, yeah, but he left this morning. Where did he go? Did he say? He said he was going to see uh, uh, the tradesmaster. All right. I'll get directions <laughs> and head there. To the tradesmasters? Okay. Mm-hmm. Is anyone going Track with you? This or guy just down. you? Yeah, I'm uh, sneaking behind, like, after. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> You're creeping through the woods after? Yep. Uh, Alright, so... However, I am doing it stealthily. 
Uh, yeah, she gives you directions to, you know, the biggest house in the city. Yeah. Um, that's his house. He's probably down at court right now. Or down in the docks, one of the three. Uh, his name's Agbalv. Tell him that Brado hey. sent you. He should be more willing to talk to you. He's kind of a dick, just a heads up. Great. <clears throat> Agbalv. What is it? Yeah. All right. Wait, Agbalt is a trade master, or he's the guy that went in the crypt? He's the trades master. What's the guy's name that went in the crypt? I don't remember, man. He was a human, green eyes, brown hair. Uh, he's he's pretty short. He's only like five foot four, five foot five. God damn. Yeah, he's a little dude. All right. And he wore All a right. uh, he wore a dark green cloak. So thanks. Shouldn't be too hard to find. Yeah, no problem. <clears throat> Yeah. And I'll set off after that. Right yep. On. So where are you heading? The the big building. You're heading to the house, the council building, or the docks. One of those three is where she said he'd probably be. The, uh, and it, like his personal residence house. Yeah, or yeah. The trade yeah. Uh, Okay, so I mean it's it's daytime, so yeah. It's like closing probably. time. It's like five. All right. The sun's getting ready to start setting. It's not quite there yet, though. Uh, <laughs> I'll head to the trade, the the, the council house okay. first, because he's probably a busy guy. Okay. There is a line out the door. Uh, probably at least thirty or forty people, but uh, a couple of guards sitting on the side. Big white out or big white building. Probably right. marble inlaid. Probably not actually made from marble, because you've heard this guy's kind of a cheap fuck. Uh, uh, alright, <laughs> I'm not really gonna wait in line, but I'm gonna ask, like, the guards if they saw, like, a short guy, brown hair, green eyes, come through, he's some sort of adventurer, he went to the jungle of fangs, I don't know if he talked about it at all. Roll me perception. Uh, and, God. uh, think if you're with him, roll perception as well. Uh, sure. Oh, damn. I actually put points in perception this time. It's pretty good. I think you have plus 18 perception. Jesus. No, no, no. That's not perception. Oh, okay. I was like, Jesus. 17. Fucking monkey Christ. No, that's still... <laughs> oh, gotcha. That makes way more sense. Uh, yeah, Anam, you spot the guy of pretty much that description walking out of the building right now, actually. All right. Tell the guys. Oh, never mind. I see him. And uh, I'm just, you know... And then catch up with him. Yeah, you head over and kind of tug on his arm. He's like, "What the? F hey, hey, hey! What's going on, man? Uh, ma'am? Nothing much. Ma'am. Ma'am is fine. Ma ma uh, I heard you went in the jungle of fangs. Yeah, man, the crypt of horror. The crypt of horror. I don't actually know what it's called. Tales from the crypt. Presumably. It had a name once, but all I know is that that fucking place killed my friend, and the trades master doesn't want to fucking send a party to go do anything about it. So, suck so, the life right out of him. It's fucking what? awful. Yep, went up, told him not to touch the door, decided to touch the door. Stuck Sounds there as if getting familiar. shocked by electricity and dropped to the ground dead. Uh, I write about, down, like, I buy don't you a touch drink. doors. And and we can talk about the script and where it is, because we'd be interested in actually going. Uh, roll Diplo. No touching. You're kind of an ugly fuck, that's the only reason I'm making oh. you Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty horrifying. Yeah. Guy. For those of you that are screaming at YouTube right now saying, Shava, you were just pissing and moaning about charisma rolls, how they don't have a place in a role-playing game two days ago. Blah, blah, blah. Fuck off. Guy has three hotness. Oh uh, yeah, he's down. There. And and he's literally with a dude <laughs> that also has three hotness. But yeah. he, the, the, <laughs> like the two the, ugliest but, people you probably but, find in the whole city. But to be fair, to be fair, the other dude probably doesn't see me because I'm stealthy. Uh, he's a little adventurer. No, I don't see. Uh, well, it'd be close. It'd be close. I don't actually feel like making this guy a stat sheet, but he is an adventurer and he rolled a nat 18, so he might see you. I mean, then he might, like, yeah. yeah. Um, Just see me creeping. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I could use a drink. 
We'll, we'll just go through the white pipe. Okay. You head back to the white pipe. Yeah. It's getting even busier somehow. It's it's like almost shoulder to shoulder in here now. Uh, rest of the party, what have you guys been up to? I have me and uh, me and Ethan. We're gonna yep. go down to the docks. Okay. We are looking indeed. for anybody who is stopping near stopping by a port near the forest of Fangs or closer to the forest of Fangs. So, like, you guys could, if you wanted to, just try to hop off in the jungle of Fangs. Um, there's a little island just off the coast uh, that people pull lumber off of because nobody wants to pull lumber out of the jungle of Fangs. Uh, there's rumor that the trees will occasionally come to life and fuck people up, and plus it's just a nasty fucking place and no one wants to pull lumber out of. Uh, so usually it's off that island just off the coast or out of Icewood Vale. So if you wanted to get on like a lumber ship, it's not going to be particularly comfy, but that's the closest you're going to get. Uh, if you just want to get to another port that's close, Hearthlande is pretty close, but... You know, Wait, to the Jungle of Fangs? Yeah. It'd be pretty much the same distances from yeah. your alt name. Well, I'll yeah. talk to the lumber and ships. We're... I don't understand. We should just walk it. Fuck it. It's about a week's worth of walking. I mean, when why not try? Yeah. Why not try this approach, my friend? <laughs> because? I'm marvelous with words. I understand, like, we have, like, a four day travel no matter how you land it, even if we take a boat. Look, all right? <laughs> Why take a boat? Because I like to be fancy. Boats and hoes. So you could, you could try to take a lumber boat, like, directly or, like, right around the corner from it. Um,. But nobody go. Nobody sails to the jungle of fangs, and there's no like civilizations within three or four days of the jungle of fangs, because yeah, it's could. a fucking nasty place. Let's just hook right, it. It's well, fine. I'll talk to. I'm gonna go up to the lumber ship. Yeah, sure. There's a big burly man there, no shirt on, covered in hair. Presumably the captain, as he's standing at the wheel, shouting orders to people, looking like he's getting ready to set sail. Uh, well, fuck it. If he's setting sail, I don't know where the others are. I don't know how long it'll take. Yeah. Fuck it, Ethan. You're right. <laughs> Waste of time. Let us go find the others if they're setting off now. All right. I don't so know when we'll be ready to leave. So we go back towards the bar. I collect my horse and things, and then we go try and find them. Okay. You head back to the bar. You guys all arrive at mysteriously the exact same time because lazy DMing. <laughs> Super coincidence. <laughs> awesome. See, no, no, no. It's just coincidence, bro. Yeah, uh, like it, like you totally rolled for it. Or what? Yeah, that... <laughs> do they yeah, have did the it. guy with them? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we heard dice rolling and it happened. It's fine. Uh, I, I... <sighs> right. So there's a guy with them. You guys are chilling at the bar. It's busy as fuck. Like, actually, it's hard to hear each other. Uh, yeah, um, I, I'm buying him like, food this? and drink. I don't know if he has like a, a place to stay for the night. I yeah, he's got a he's got a room. But I'm, I, trying I to, I'm, I'm trying to like butter him up, right? Yeah. As Rinian as as Rinian so as who uh, is this? Like, I'm like, I, I, don't, I don't really know, but I don't trust him. He says he wants whiskey. Are you down? With I don't right. trust him at all. It's all right, Fink. Stand it in shadows. Yeah, I'll, I'll Make buy sure it. Make sure you watch. Unless it's like super extravagant. Also, <laughs> also, also, don't touch fucking doors. They kill you apparently. It's two silver a drink. Yeah. I'll trust you. Sure. Yeah, I know you're very smart. Very intuitive. I buy him a double. Okay, cool. This definitely improves his mood towards you. Uh, there's um, somebody, and by somebody I mean it's Jeffrey, uh, in the corner playing some music. Uh, and like I said, it's, it's pretty loud in here, pretty raucous. Uh, Jeffrey or Joffrey? Jeffrey, not Joffrey. Okay. <laughs> shall I, uh, I shall I continue to butter him up, Anna? Sure, sure. My mm -hmm. good Can sir, I, I I approach the the. Uh, what's his his name, by the way. Adam, Adam, what's his name? I don't know. <laughs> we just met. <laughs> Literally, my good asked sir. His name yet. I have seen that my party members have bought you good drink, but I have yet to be introduced. What is your name? I am Isaiah. Uh, the name is Kuno. Nice to meet you, Kuno. I shake his hand. Yeah, you shake your hand. So you're Perhaps a friend I, of the, I can uh... offer my grievances for your uh, loss of a friend. I too know what it is like to lose someone close. I pat him on the back. He nods. Takes a sip of his drink. 
I've been listening um, to a dude who knows about the jungle but, thing. Got it. I know it, it perhaps could bring up uh, bad memories. Hmm. As no doubt my party has told you, we are interested in this crypt that you guys have discovered in the forest. Yeah. Um, is it possible that you could give me more details? Or do I need to buy you some more drinks? I could lead you there, I suppose. But I want to cut. How big of a cut, sir? I mean, how many of there? Are, how many of you are there? I kind of With you, that'd be five. Twenty percent seems fair. I found it. Then there we go. We'll split it fifths. All right. Yeah, I could lead you guys there. You guys got a carriage or horses or anything? Are we hoofing it? What's the plan? Uh, I do have a horse. Uh, my companions, I'm not so sure. Companions. <laughs> I have a horse. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I ride I ride on the back with you. All right, yeah, I have a I, ha I actually have also a mule. I also have a mule. Right. Think, Shit! I could totally right be riding, on, riding on that mule. Think, I'm think totally riding on that mule. Yeah, yeah. that fits. But, but, but it doesn't. There's like, no way you're riding on, on my horse. Like so hangs no. yeah, off the side yeah, where yeah. we're not looking. Like on the yeah, other side. yeah, yeah. I'm totally like. <laughs> there's there's I'm, like I'm, eight I'm... there's like eight different outfits on the mule. You could just like hide underneath them. I'm totally still on the mule. <laughs> Just like, trying to fit in. There are actually a ton of, like, I'll, sh I'll tell you what's on my mule. Ten God's Brew, ten common coffees, ten, five exotic coffees, ten common teas, five dwarven stout <laughs> ales, two bufos, two meads that are each eight pounds, so that's like fucking 16 pounds of mead. Uh, six Lenorum meads, two dragon punch whiskeys, two... You have dragon punch? Holy yep. shit! How the hell is, isn't Dragon Punch like 400 gold? Nah. Uh, yeah, it's 50 gold a piece or something like that. Damn. I have two Lug Lurch Ales, two, five Old Jaw Whiskeys, four Fine Wines, one Sea Lord Wines, which is actually like 120 gold. Mm -hmm. And then oh, I, yeah, have, gold wines I have two plenty hide, hide between. I have two chocolate bars as well that are on my person in case we run into swarms of orphans. Oh. <laughs> or if we run you into Dementor, throw chocolate at him and run away. Because you know what you need when you run into a Dementor <laughs> is chocolate. Yeah. And then I also gonna have an entertainer's outfit, an explorer's outfit, a monk's outfit, a noble's outfit, a peasant's outfit, and fur. Many outfits. Yeah. So I'm just <laughs> hiding like in between the pile of clothes then. All right. <laughs> Do you stash yourself in the clothes? Also, like I'm. <laughs> you have totally a little nest in up. there. Yeah. That you curled up in. But but the doll doesn't answer if we have like a horse for Kuno or does he have a horse? Kuno, he has a horse. Perhaps do you have your own sort of uh, travel? If not, I've got a like, horse. Yeah, if that's how you well, guys want to get back there, we'll have to go through the Lande. But sorry, right. unless you guys want to go across the plains, I suppose we could pick up some food. But I have plenty of food, my friend. All right, when are we leaving? Tomorrow. It's late. Perhaps on the morrow. Works for me. Is that good with you? Yeah. And there we go. Let us drink and be merry tonight. He lifts his glass again. Doesn't seem very merry. But cheers anyways. And drops the I thing. come out of the shadow and I'm like into into uh, as Rinian's here. I still don't trust him. Good job, I'm gonna keep. I'm, I'm going to keep an eye on him. That's your role. That's your role. You have to make sure that he doesn't backstab us. <clears throat> Before back watch, watch from underneath all the furs on my donkey. Uh, yeah. How much money for a room and board? Food uh, and board? Six silver per room? For food and room? Alright, well, I pay for myself. Okay. Yeah. Two silver, you said? Uh, it does come with poached dragon, though, is on the menu. And delicious. Yeah, it's really fucking good. It's awesome. Yeah. Super Did good. you say six silver? They're they're here at the yeah. White Pipe. Their specialty is you know, smoke first off, but then secondly they've got poached dragon and whiskey, and that's kind of their big menu items. All right, I'll give them uh, Well, um, I don't have anything specific I want to do other than I'm going to use a diplomacy check to talk <laughs> up everything and hear about some rumors. All right, cool. Uh, roll... Uh, roll Diplo. 27. Fuck it, whatever. Okay, uh, roll me a d7. 
I guess I know a D7 doesn't exist, but I wrote seven rumors, goddammit. Five. Actually, I guess it's a D6, because I already gave you one. Uh, Alright. So, uh, rumor has it, you guys pick up throughout the night, uh, you hear a couple of old bats that are, like, sitting in the corner, mumbling to themselves. Uh, you Is it the uh, Batman? No. Old hags, rather. Oh, sitting okay. in the corner, mumbling to themselves. I'm just, uh, I'm just making sure here. <clears throat> They're it's a vampire. They're talking Get about him, an, guys. Old, an old monastery that's in the Twilight Vale uh, that is supposedly haunted by ghosts nowadays. Uh, Ooh. And roll another one, a d4. Three. Uh, three. Uh, you guys, you hear rumor that some crazy fucking wizard in Thalande named Bereslin, uh has discovered or created some new form of magic that's never before been seen here. Uh, apparently he's transforming people every single day nowadays, and he's trying to get more people to uh, come test out this new experiment as he sits. Uh, Any really... idea like what the magic is supposed to do? Is yes. there a rumor on that? You guys can investigate more if you like. But that's all that you overhear. Oh, I'm oh, actively going It sounds up pretty up. bad if he's, if he's transforming so that's what, people. That's what shit. people are saying. I go up and I, I'm with my diplom. I'm not listening in. I'm in, talking with people. Uh, yeah, I don't really know, man. Um, something to do with being able to like bend the elements to his will uh, and supposedly it I, I, the avatar? I don't know man I don't know that it, doesn't sound very good I shall inform my shaman friend immediately thank you for your time good sir and I plop a silver down buy yourself a drink yeah something to be able to infuse them into people or something I don't know man it's fucking crazy wizard shit stay the hell out of the long day bro has he Air become Bender? a summoner with sim uh what's it called Sym symbiosis or whatever that fucking op archetype is called possibly synthesis uh, yes. yeah synthesis Alrighty, well, other than that, I just go around and I be a general good it's person. It's photosynthesis for <laughs> everybody like, in the inn. Open up to the Make sun. sure they remember my name. Yeah, that takes you a couple of hours worth of wandering around and chatting people up. Uh, obviously, you hear other things too, but nothing really of all that much use. Oh, Ted stole You hear my that pig. Ben is cheating oh, on Jill Ted's for the third time yeah, this month. You hear that Jen and fucking Tom are arguing about who cooked the last chicken and. So by the way, uh, have we rolled for cooking skill? Carrie and Mr. Big got back I together I haven't again. rolled for cooking skill, no. What is cooking? I have a 7. 3d6 plus whiz. I have a 7. 15. Whew. Damn. Damn, dude. Had a boy. Whipping up that French toasted sausage. 36 6 plus... Alright, we're going on break as soon as these whiz rolls come out. Did what the fuck know? is... Uh, I, I already rolled it. Alright. Oh, I can't see any rules for some reason. What? Are you on the drugs? It wrecked. Just scroll down, Bergson. Just scroll down. No, I, my, my roll 20 must have fucked up. I'm reloading it. Oh, God. Just roll. What's your whiz your model? I'll roll for you. Plus one. But I want to roll myself. I'll even use real dice. Uh, are you sure you want to roll yourself? The way you say it, I think I should say no. <laughs> Do you trust the server? But, but then the server, the server you... could always be the server. Three, three cooking, three hot, three <laughs> yeah, cooking. I know. I'm like, I'm really hoping here. I'm really hoping. You I mean, just I'm, actually die I would by actually, himself if he didn't I would like people. if I had three cooking. I would find that hilarious. As soon as roll 20 roll happens, you don't get what I rolled. Okay, your call. I, I'm good with your roll then. 13. Damn it. <laughs> Can we take the, the one away from in front of it? No. It's what if he rolls less but, than but, but 10 out of the 100? Cooks, he only cooks...